Welcome to What Wendy Wears. My name is Wendy and today is all about Shein's one-piece bathing suits and cover-ups. Spring is right around the corner and a lot of us are getting ready to either go on vacation or hit the pool. So we have a great haul for you today. So let's go ahead and get started with the first swimsuit. <music> is going to be two pieces. We're going to take a look at the cover-up and we're going to take a look at the swimsuit. The cover-up is a poncho style. It has a deep V here. You could actually make it even deeper, but it has a tie at the very top where it connects together. So if you need to separate it to make it a little wider, you have the option to do that. Um, and I love the fact that it has this detail going down the back. Now, um, it does have little tassels throughout the dress or the cover-up, which is really nice. And it has like this really nice detail and it is made out of polyester. So uh, this is the poncho. It, fit, it will probably fit a lot of sizes because it does only come in one size. Uh, just keep that in mind. It is pretty wide um, and it opens up pretty wide at the top as well because it does tie in the back. Now, um, the swimsuit which I uh, really, really love. Uh, this is a one-piece swimsuit and it has a little opening here in the center and it, um, it could be a little tighter. I didn't tie it as tight as I normally would. It does have cups on the, um, inside the bathing suit. Usually I don't like the cups. I usually end up taking them out anyways. Um, it does have a little tie here on the side. So if you wanna make it a little shorter, you have the uh, option of doing that. Or if you, you're a little bit shorter on the torso and you need to shorten it, you have the capability of doing that as well. I really do like this print. This print reminds me of the tropics. So if you are going to like a beach area, I really think that this color would look great. Um, in the back, it is full coverage and it does crisscross on the back. I'm not a big fan of halters because with halter tops, they do tend to um, get really tight in around the neck. So that's why with this one crisscrossing on the back and it uh, ties here on the side, I really, really like that. So uh, swimsuit, yes, uh, I also love the cover up. I really think that they go great together. So this next outfit is two pieces. It is the cover up and also the bathing suit. So the cover up is a color block style with the green, black, and white. And I really do like this cover up. It is a knit material. It has a slit on the side. It goes just past my shins. And I really think that when you're out and about and you have this material along with the bathing suit underneath, it looks really good. Um, I like the fact that it's like a tank top style um, here in the back. It goes up pretty high. Um, this does have sizes to it, unlike the first piece where it was a one size fit, fits most. This one here is actually going to be tailored to whatever size you are. Um, so let's go ahead and take a look at the swimsuit. So this swimsuit is not my favorite. Um, as you can see, it's white and green. I like the pattern and the design of the swimsuit, but it just doesn't fit my body correctly. Now, the way that it cuts up into me, I just don't like that because it has me overflowing here on my hips and I just don't like it. Um, in addition to that, the way the, um, the pads or the breast area where it starts, it's way down here, it just doesn't fit me right. So I don't like that. The straps here are adjustable. However, because of the size of the torso, it just doesn't fit right. And then here, I crisscrossed it and tied it behind my neck. Um, I'm not a big fan of halter top styles, so I know that wearing this for a while is going to start hurting the back of my neck. And so for that reason, I don't like that. But here's what the back looks like. It is a little cheeky on the back. Um, but if you like it, you like it, but this just doesn't fit my body correctly. So I don't buy too many accessories from Shein, but I did love this fedora hat. And I just think that it looks so good when you are outside to protect you from the sun, but also to look a little stylish. I really do like this hat. So um, I purchased this hat. It is a straw hat. 
and um, it comes kind of crushed. But the great thing is, is that it expands really easily. So as you can see, it doesn't look like it's been crushed or anything like that, which I really, really do like. So let's go ahead and take a look at my cover up. So this cover up that I got is black and it is sheer, which I do like. It's very lightweight. You do have the option to make it tighter around the waist if you like. However, I don't need to, uh, but if you want to, you can, you have that option. Uh, the sleeves are gr a great size and just the way that it fits, I really, really like how it shapes me. Uh, the back is a really good length as well. Um, and I really like the, the length and the texture of this material. So let's go ahead and take a look at the swimsuit. So this is going to be my favorite swimsuit that I've tried on so far. I still have one more that I want to try on, but I love the fact that this is kind of pointing and angling down. So it gives you more of a curve to your body and it really does have good support at the top for this bathing suit. And I love the fact that it has these thicker straps on your shoulders. So it's not digging into you if you have a bigger chest. But I do love the way it feels, the way it fits, and this is what the back looks like. And I absolutely love the different colors on this bathing suit. So this one is an absolute yes. So this is the last swimsuit, and I wish I could say that I loved it because I absolutely love the color and the cut of this swimsuit. Now, I love the fact that it has this little uh, decoration here, this little design, and it continues all the way down to the back of the swimsuit. So I love that fact. However, what is wrong with this swimsuit for my body is where it has the stitching. The stitching is here on the swimsuit and my busts don't start till up here. And the pockets of this swimsuit for the bust and the padding start at this um, stitching. So it's like floating all the way around everywhere. And that is my issue as far as the swimsuit is that the bust area just does not fit me properly. Um, I love the fact that it is um, where it rises on the side. It's not too high and it's not too low when it comes to the hip area. Um, the color, like I mentioned, I do love it. And I love the fact that um, it does not have any clips or anything that you have to uh, put on. And I love the fact that it is pretty low cut. But again, I just wish that this stitching was maybe about three or four inches higher. That way it would fit my body a little better. If you had a shorter torso, then it would probably fit you a little better because of the location of where this stitching is. But unfortunately for me, this has to be a no. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please hit the like notification bell and also subscribe to my channel. Leave a comment below. Let me know which one of the outfits or the bathing suits you like the best. In addition, if you want to see how I style some of these items, you can go over to my Instagram page where I style some of these items and some of the items that I had from some of my previous hauls. Uh, there on my Instagram page, What Wendy Wears. Um, I am not affiliated, affiliated or sponsored by Shein. All of the thoughts are my own thoughts. So if you want to see another video, I went ahead and linked a video here that you might like. In addition to that, to make it easier for you to subscribe, you can go ahead and hit my image at the top here and you can subscribe to my channel. Thank you so much. I appreciate all of my subscribers and all of my watchers. So stay stylish, my friends.